Hello, this is Ron Alexander from Dallas, Texas. Today I want to introduce you to the LP64 multiband compressor. Now, a traditional compressor is the one we've studied so far, is a single band compressor and it works over the entire audio spectrum of 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz, whereas a multiband compressor breaks the audio spectrum into regions. For example, in a five band compressor, the low region could be from 20 to 125 hertz, the low mid from 60 to 500 hertz, the mid from 250 hertz to 2 kilohertz, high mid from 1k to 8k, and the high region from 4k to 20 kilohertz. Note there's some overlap there so that we don't lose uh, any audio information going from one compressor to the other. Uh, the multiband compressor in this case is actually five traditional compressors combined into one, so each of the five bands have separate attack, release, threshold, ratio, and gain control. Okay, uh, here's the uh, LP64 multiband compressor. And as you can see, it's divided up into five regions. Low frequency, low mid frequencies, mid frequencies, high mid, and high frequencies. And that covers the entire frequency uh, span of 20 to 20 kilohertz. And note that each one of these bands has a separate controls, compressor controls for it. Attack, release, threshold, ratio, and gain. Now basically what we've got this set up, I've got the um, attack longer on the lower bands and shorter on the uh, higher bands. The um, release, the threshold, and the ratio are, are all the same in each band, and the gains are different. Uh, now I can grab these, each of these bands, and I can change the gain just by dragging the waveform and also change the uh, center frequency and the, the of the uh, bandpass filter uh, that in so it's very easy to use I want to show you an example of how to use it uh, first off we'll listen to the program material I've recorded sounds like this This is uncompressed. Sounds okay, but perhaps we can improve it. So in order to do that, I turn this button on here, and I've enabled this compressor now. Let's listen to it. And I'll be flipping back and forth so you can compare uncompressed to compressed. drag around these uh, waveforms as I showed you earlier and let's hear how the sound changes as I uh, drag each individual uh, band uh, changing its gain and center frequency Okay, that's it. Thanks uh, for listening to my overview of the LP64 multiband compressor. Goodbye.